arrangements and I got home and Don said, someone sent you flowers and it was yellow roses, which was one of my dad's favorites, but you had no idea. We never talked to that level. And uh, I just, those are the things you remember. And that was in 2007. That's a long time ago. So thank you. You do it too. Thank you. And you can go to your meeting. I, do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to go. <laughs> a lot of familiar faces from the field. I had the opportunity to meet Brenda day two on my job 20 years ago yep. in May of 98 mm -hmm. in a, a with Crystal. Yeah. Crystal, uh, May. Crystal, May. Crystal May at the time was in, in the area. Uh, I would spend some time in card uh, for, for four or five months but um, we were in a training lab on the back of a branch and Dixie, uh, Dixie need more. And uh, you know, here I am. I'm, I'm like in college. I have no clue. But all I remember, uh, 20 years as it is today, uh, is throughout my journey. You know, it's always been family. Uh, it's always been uh, catching up with my colleagues around. Brenda was always understood my girls. Uh, how's Nicole doing? And always stayed in touch when I was in Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. You always supported us, and you you helped shepherd us through. Uh, when I was in Florida, uh, you and Lee and, and gave us what we needed uh, when we were growing. And uh, most importantly, like everyone else, I just remember day two on the job, Brenda Schreiber and sitting down and she, she sat down like everyone's describing. And, and I, many times when I thought about leaving the firm or opportunities, you go back to people like Brenda that really leave an impact uh, in, in not only your life, but also your, your work. And um, you know, I, again, it's a huge loss today, but obviously a big gain for your family. And uh, I can't personally thank you enough for all the mentorship, friendship, and uh, making this firm better. And, um, that's impactful 20 years on day two. Um, and those are the types of things that you always were the threat. You always were the threat for us. So uh, again, can't thank you enough. Oh, thank you. Together, but um, uh, we partnered as I'm an instructional developer and of course a trainer and a manager of trainers and what I really appreciated it um, is that sometimes instructional developers and trainers don't always have the best relationship at times but yeah. you and your team especially Vicki and I know there's others here um, we just had a lot of fun together great partnership and I always appreciated that but the one thing I do want to share is what I always remember is I think what your personal brand is, is your bouncy, swingy hair. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. and, and I've, always, I've always loved your hair. But the other, <laughs> I thought a couple of weeks ago, I was um, at Target, and I was walking on the island. I know you sort of live, in, or at least you did live near me. Yeah, so I, I saw somebody with this bouncy blonde hair. I was like, oh, there's Brenda. So I kind of threw a at that job. And I was just about to go, hey. And it wasn't you. <laughs> so there's somebody out there. With, but that's how I remember. That's your personal brand. Oh, I'm coming to get a hug. Oh, sure. yeah. OK, thank you. Yeah. So I know we're getting close to wrapping up, but we do have a couple of gifts to present you with, um, Brenda. So Gina is going to uh, take the honor of presenting you with the gifts. So Brenda, I mean, you've heard the words, and, and you'll continue to hear from folks that are here and from afar. So we've got a word cloud that I hope will help really, you know, cement some of the memories and fond words. Um, that you've heard people say. And in addition, it, we needed a trunk <laughs> to the cards. And you know, I'd say it, it's a nice memento and so many people contributed. There's photos, there's oh, cards. Dear. I know, Brenda. And the, yeah, and you'll enjoy looking at that in your spare time. Just, yeah, I'll have some time. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Brenda, it's important to note that some of the cards are coming through inner office, so you will have to show up about four months from now. To <laughs> 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 I like that tactic, though, that would be a good idea. Right. Uh, so uh, before we wrap up, Brenda, I just wanted to give you the floor um, for any closing comments before we go. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> now, what's oh, boy me? <laughs> Thank you so much for everybody.
everybody that came today. I am so humbled and so touched by your words. Um, from my family who has supported me through this journey and, you know, all the travel that we do. And um, Don would always say, it's okay. And he'd tell the boys, Dad's cooking tonight, which means they were going out to eat. <laughs> and, um, you know, and I, I remember specifically one time I went out to the car, one very early morning, because you know how it is, it was probably 4.30 in the morning. And I pulled off my, um, hey, I pulled off my windshield and my oldest had written a note and put on the note, we love you, Mom. Love Dad, Ben, and Adam. And I kept that for a very long time because when you travel, you wonder what damage you're doing. You, because during that time, you're not home at night. You don't know what's going on. You can talk to them on the phone. That was before FaceTime, a lot of it, but you don't know. Um, I really never wanted to work outside the home. I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom. But God had a different plan for my life. And when he brought me here, I started as a secretary receptionist. I didn't hardly know how to type, but that's what I was doing. <laughs> I could answer phones until I answered the phone, welcome to Bank Ohio. That was a former competitor. And then they talked to maybe I'd like to do something else. <laughs> and then found out my background, and the rest became history. But I've always said, God left me here for a purpose. And I never really understood it, but I think I do today. And it probably took me 27 years. I love the people at Chase. It is not about the octagon on the building. It never has been. It's never about the decisions that's been made, because let's be honest, we don't agree with a lot of them. So, um, but we execute because it's the right thing to do. But it's about the people. And I will tell you, there's no finer group of people than the people who work at Chase. Because of the hours we work, how hard as we work, we work as family. And so this is my second family. I've been blessed with this one, and I've been blessed with the secondary family. So this decision was not an easy one. Yes, I'm old. It is time. <laughs> <laughs> when they put the ping pong tables up, I was like, <laughs> I don't fit in. <laughs> know what I'm talking about just I'm the only one that will have yeah and as I began to lose my filters I thought probably it's <laughs> that I, I should probably move on but I have loved training and training is just the bomb number one because I can't master it there's always something I could have done more better different less and you're all nodding that's been there because you know that but I thank all of you for my journey because you've helped me grow to be the person that I am I will miss all of you. So when y'all say you've got my number, I know how it is. You'll remember it for a little bit, and then time goes on. But um, I'm entering the fourth quarter of my life, and I'm excited about that to see what God has an opportunity for me. I personally don't believe in retirement. I think you just change what you do. So I'm about to change what I'm going to do. You have humbled me by your presence. Uh, you've humbled me by the kind words and the grace that you've shown to me throughout my career. Uh, Kim and Lee, if Lee's still on the phone, have been phenomenal managers. I met what I said to Lee. I would never want to manage me. Um, <laughs> it is not an easy thing to do. Um, I, I will obey to a point, and then we do what's right. Uh, but, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> She's so not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I am humbled by all of this. Thank you. My last day actually is Wednesday, so I'm out of my cube. But you know, I'm still. You'll see me ghosting through the halls. But I do wish um, God's richest blessings on all of you. That you find the, the peace and the contentment that only He can give. And just thank you. you. I am very humbled by your presence today. Hey, how are you? <laughs> <laughs>